In this tutorial, we will teach you how to change a worksheet structure and use the auto sum function in Excel. In an Excel sheet, you can add rows and columns using the insert option. In order to insert a row in the sheet, select any row, right click, and click on the insert option from the menu that appears. With that done, a small window will pop up. From here you can select where you want to shift the cells. Select the shift cells down option and the row will be shifted downwards. Similarly, you can shift entire columns in the sheet. If you want to get the sum of all the values in the sheet, highlight all of them and click on the Auto Sum button, which is located on the ribbon bar in the Home tab. Notice that we highlighted a few blank cells as well. This is because you have to define where the sum will be displayed on the sheet. Once you hit the Auto Sum button, the output will be displayed in the column titled Total. Just to be sure, press Control plus tilde on your keyboard to see the formulas that have been applied and the rows and columns that have been selected for the formula. Just as the rows and columns had been inserted, they can be removed from the sheet as well. To do so, select the column you want to delete, right-click on it, and select the Delete option from the menu. 